Local weight loss coach Charles D'Angelo is learning a thing or two about big business. This December, his first book, Think and Grow Thin, hits the shelves. He lays out the no-nonsense diet plan that helped hundreds of people lose weight. It's the same diet plan he used. Before he became the fit motivator, Charles was an overweight kid. Adults who are overweight often face several prejudices, including that they're lazy or they don't want to lose weight. Well, weight loss coach Charles D'Angelo actually left the Channel 11 set to talk to me personally, and he said that children face those same prejudices too. Unfortunately, if, especially going into high school, it's a highly stressful time, all sorts of awkward things come about at that time, a lot of what we call stress in Western culture, right? How did they deal with stress growing up? How did mom and dad deal with stress growing up? Well, it's lunchtime, hmm, and that ice cream sure does look good. And I know if I eat that ice cream, I'm gonna feel a lot different after I eat that, and else I'll feel good. Every time I've eaten ice cream for the last 14 years, I felt good afterwards. If that has become a conditioned behavior, rather than I will feel tired, I will feel totally unfocused, I'll be falling asleep during class the rest of the afternoon. Unless you learn how to make this plan, unless you learn how to disassociate emotion from food, your obesity epidemic is going to continue to run rapid in our culture. You need to learn how to change how you feel without indulging in such, in such unhealthy behavior. It's much like an addict, much like an alcoholic. An alcoholic becomes addicted to these drinks, to this substance, to get a feeling. And it becomes so ingrained in who they are and their identity that they find it difficult to break that bondage, break that link. But would you say that children, seeing how their brains are still developing? I think that they're forming many associations that can be extraordinarily detrimental to their future. That's News 11's own weight loss coach, Charles D'Angelo, and I'm Kim Hudson. You just took today's first step. And we want to hear your thoughts on today's. Tell us what you think about the fight against childhood obesity from today's first steps, plus the Jakeology on the goals of Occupy St. Louis. Head to our Facebook page and leave a comment about those stories. We, of course, will read some of your comments a little later in the hour. Still ahead at.